Home Affairs and Law Minister Keshan Mugam says threats mentioning the 9-11 attacks have been made against Singapore by supporters of an Indonesian preacher who was denied entry into the country. Last Monday, Abdul Somad Batubara, as well as six people who were travelling with him from Batam, were turned away at Singapore's borders over what MHA called extremist and segregationist teachings. Mr Shanmugam spoke to reporters today. One comment which uh, Meta has uh, disabled, you know, it's disabled the account for violating community standards and it removed the comment. And I quote, it says, Dear you, the leaders of Singapore, the Islamophobic countries, we are waiting two times 24 hours to apologize to the Indonesian people and Muslims. If you ignore our warning, then we will not hesitate to expel the ambassador of your country. We will send Islamic defender troops prosperous justice troops and ulama defender troops to attack your country like 9-11 in New York, 2001. And we will also expel Singaporeans who pretend to transit and live in Indonesia. So a very direct threat linking to 9-11 against Singapore, Singaporeans, uh, both here and in, in Indonesia. I think one shouldn't dismiss them completely because you know parallels are being drawn with 9-11 parallels are being drawn with uh, Singaporeans uh, being led by non-Islamic uh, leaders yeah. and that Singapore should be attacked Singaporean interests should be attacked so I wouldn't be dismissive of the comments Mr. Shanmugam also reveals that some people who have been investigated under the Internal Security Act were followers of Somad. This includes a 17-year-old who was detained in January 2022. Somad, uh, we have known of him for some time. You know, some of the people that ISD has investigated in Singapore for radicalization, one of the things we picked up is that they were watching videos of uh, Somad were following his uh, preachings. One of them is, uh, was a 17-year-old detained under the Internal Security Act in uh, two years ago, January 2020. He had watched Somat's YouTube lectures on suicide bombing. And the young boy began to believe that if you fought for ISIS and if you are a suicide bomber, you will die, you can die as a martyr and receive rewards in heaven. So you can see so much preachings have real world consequences. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to be notified of new videos.